and welcome to the cottage. So as you can see in the camera, um, I have Zola with me. Um, and the reason being is because um, my ladies Facebook group that I often talk about, um, we have Theme Friday. And this week, uh, Theme Friday is um, dress your baby in your favorite color, not your favorite color to put on your doll or your baby, um, but your actual personal favorite color. So um, I'm getting uh, Zola changed uh, so I can do a photo shoot with her and I just thought it would be fun for you guys to hang out with this while I get her changed. And um, I did something really, really crazy today, you guys, and I'm kind of excited to tell you about it, I think. I don't know. We'll see. Anyway, I'm going to show you. Of course, you guys all know I don't have to um, explain myself. You guys know pink is my all-time favorite color. And um, I am going to dress Zola in. I'm actually going to dress Zola in this gorgeous... I don't know if you guys are seeing this or not. This is actually Lily's Easter dress. Um, but I think that it will look really beautiful on Zola. And it is, it's satin. Um, it's got a satin underskirt. And, and then it's got also another uh, satin underskirt with a crinoline. And then it has got um, tulle, like a tulle. Um, overskirt and then it's got little tiny rosebuds satin rosebuds on it and this gorgeous bow I just oh my gosh I love this dress isn't it so beautiful and this is my all-time favorite color pink so I'm gonna be putting that on her and um, and then I've got a few different options for tights I've got some baby pink ones and then I've got some brand new white ones that I've not even tried on the babies yet and um, and then look at this is my favorite all-time favorite headband that Auntie Jenny sent us and um, I've got some noodle and boo so I can <laughs> tame those wild curls and um, I'm going to I think I'm just gonna change her laying down because um, because she looks really nice and comfy. Don't you, Zola? You look so comfy. Okay, so I have to tell you what I did today. And I know some of you will probably be thinking, like, oh my gosh, Julie, what were you thinking? But I don't know, you guys, curiosity got the better of me, to be honest. So, um, I ordered a doll. Um, <laughs> Layla. <laughs> Are you feeling left out? I've been playing with the babies quite a bit today, and I think Layla's actually starting to feel a little bit like put out because I spent so much time with the babies today. Um, but she shouldn't because every day is Layla day. Anyway, you guys, this is the crazy thing I did. I ordered a Amazon, uh, uh, like I'm going to say a reborn type doll um, from Amazon. And I have never done that before. And, you know, a lot of my dolly friends have been doing that. And I just, the curiosity just got the better of me. And this company called Terabithia on Amazon, so it's, you know, a Chinese company, like a dolly or, you know, one of those um, pinky or um, they have dolls for sale um, and they're having a sale right now and I just yeah I, and completely to I mean I, I I needed another doll like like a hole in the head but I just curiosity just really got the best of me now I did not order a um, replica sculpt um, the baby that I ordered is a not for what I could see, it was not a recognizable sculpt. Um, but um, 
because I, I still, you know, I'm not um, feeling comfortable in adding a, a replica to my collection at this time. But no judgment uh, whatsoever to those of you, my friends, who do have a replica. Um, but the company that I ordered from Terabithia, um, I, I'm fairly certain they do have uh, replica sculpts uh, for sale on Amazon. I kind of more um, was interested in kind of, you know, because it was a really good sale, um, I'm kind of interested in like the quality of these dolls because um, this baby that I ordered was with the sale, it was like 60 bucks delivered. So that is um, like for me to get a Paradise Galleries doll, um, like to order from Paradise Galleries, I'm looking at about $300 and an Ashton Drake doll um, will run anywhere from, yeah, like anywhere from 160 up to, you know, three, four hundred dollars. So this baby that I've ordered, um, it delivered to my door. Oh my gosh. And that's the other thing that's really cool is I ordered it this morning. I ordered her, I should say this morning and she's going to be delivered tomorrow. Like how cool is that? I mean, I've never even heard of that. Like, I'm still kind of doubtful that's going to actually happen, but that's what they're saying on Amazon, that she is going to be delivered tomorrow. So, okay, how am I going to do this? So, yeah, so I order her. She's going to be delivered to her. And, and, like, this is really cool for me, you guys, because I live in a fairly remote, oops, sorry, Zola, um, part of Canada on an island and I have never had something delivered, you know, even if it was something from like my own, own neighborhood, I've never had anything delivered that quickly. So yeah, I, or, and, and like she's on sale, she was like on sale for, um, oh my gosh, you guys, I think she is, she is going to look so amazing, so amazing in this. Oh my goodness. My beautiful, beautiful girl. Look at her. Um, anyway, yeah, one day, one day shipping. We'll see if that actually happens or not. But one day shipping to the farm um, for, I think, $60. So, no, you know, shipping is free. And she's a 22-inch, 22-inch uh, baby girl. And in the picture, she looks beautiful. Like, she really does. She looks beautiful. She's a, an AA baby. Or, um, actually, she's kind of more biracial, I guess you'd say. Oh, my goodness gracious, you guys. Look at my girl. Look how beautiful. Oh, my gosh. Look how beautiful she is. Oh, my gosh. Look at you, you're so, oh my gosh, mommy loves you. Um, <clears throat> anyway, so yeah, uh, she is being supposedly delivered tomorrow. Um, she's from a company called Terabithia, and like I said, it, it does appear that they do, um, do some replicas. She doesn't, I'm fairly certain she's not. A replica um, I think she's one of their own sculpts and I um, don't know how much of this you guys are seeing um, but look at this girl look at that face and um, yeah she's being delivered tomorrow to the farm and I am going to do uh, I'm gonna do a review on her because she is a um, you know, a reborn type, reborn, obviously not a reborn, she's a manufactured doll, but she's a reborn type doll um, for like $60 delivered to my door in 24 hours. And I want to see like what kind of quality this doll is. Like what, it, what's she like? Um, because like I said, I, th there's no doll, um, 
of any kind of quality that I can um, purchase. <laughs> you guys, I'll move you over here. You can watch me struggle with these tights. I think I'm actually putting them on backwards. I mean, <laughs> you guys, you got to see these legs. Look at these legs. Oh my gosh. Chunky monkey. Now, Zola, I don't want you to think that mommy is calling you out because you know mommy's a chunky, chunky, chunky mommy too. We like our chunky girls around here. Me included. Anyway, um, yeah, so I'm that I, I just think this is like I, I think this is hilarious. Like I really do. I'm gonna have this baby delivered to my door in like 24 hour period. Um she's you know under a hundred dollars, so way cheaper than Ashton Drake or um uh Paradise Galleries for me here in Canada. I know you guys in the US, my friend Christy gets Paradise Galleries babies. For like, you know, 50 bucks, which is, um, well, that's American though, right? So um, that would be more like 75 here or even 80, depending on what our dollar is worth. But I mean, if this turns out to be a nice doll, um, that's going to be really interesting. Very interesting. Because like I said, a lot of my dolly friends have been purchasing babies on Amazon and I have not ever done that before other than my Behringer baby I did purchase my Behringer baby but that's kind of a whole different thing you know Behringer babies are made in Spain and you know they're they're kind of you know we kind of know what they're all about I'm having to pull her onesie down a little bit because these capped sleeves are too short for her three-quarter length arms but that's okay I think I think I'll push them up maybe a little bit look at these tights they actually fit her these baby pink tights <laughs> look at these legs look at these legs oh my gosh okay I'm gonna have to sit her up Layla <laughs> you guys look at Layla look at Layla She's like crashed. Okay, so I have to sit her up. Um, I've got to move Layla over a little bit. Layla, you gotta move her on that side. Sorry, baby. Okay, I've got to sit her up because um I'm gonna spritz her hair and just give it a little scrunch. And uh and then I've gotta get her set up. Look how gorgeous you guys. Oh my gosh, my girl. My gosh. Yeah, so look for that video, you guys. I will be opening that baby. Um, I don't know, maybe I'm, I'm going to that Once Upon a Child to check out their, um, their Zara Mini sale tomorrow. So... If she actually gets delivered, I will be doing a very honest review of her um, on my channel. And so if you're interested in seeing what a uh, under $100 Amazon baby is like <laughs> delivered in 24 hours, I still can't, I'm sorry, I keep saying that, I just can't even believe that, like that's never happened in all the time that I've lived on this island, like, or any, or anywhere I've lived, because we've always lived in somewhat of a remote location, always on, you know, like a farm or a ranch or acreage of some type, so I've just never had anything delivered within 24 hours. Got her beautiful, beautiful hair. See much, see, see how much happier she is? Um, <laughs> after she, uh, I don't know if you guys watched my last video. I made a video earlier today, a haul video, and she was very pouty because she was wanting her, <laughs> look at this, Layla's trying to make herself comfy, because she was wanting her bunny slippers that I bought her at Winners, and uh, ever since she got her bunny slippers, she's been in a much better mood today. 
Okay, I'm just going to figure out how. You know what I feel like? I feel like I'm going to put this over her. She has human hair. Um, AA uh, human hair. And it's amazing. It's so soft and so beautiful. And I feel like that might... Oh my gosh, look. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, baby. You're so beautiful. Look how beautiful she is, you guys. I'm going to move her back. I mean, I'm going to move you back, not her. And just so you can see. Look at Layla peeking over the top. Layla, you just got to get in there, don't you, girl? Um, look how beautiful she looks. Oh my gosh. You know what, you guys? I've really been seriously considering piercing her ears. But, you know, I've only pierced my one. Um, Maya, my little sleeping uh, baby girl, um, she's the only one that I've pierced her ears. Uh, because, I don't know, I'm just so chicken. I'm so, so chicken. I wish Spring Flower would come over and do it for me. Because she does her babies like so zip zap and they're done. Look at. Is that not a picture you guys? For my um, ladies group. What's my favorite color? <laughs> pink. So pink. Anyway. Um, <laughs> I'm going to do a photo shoot with this gorgeous girl. For my ladies group and uh, yeah so stay tuned for my first Amazon reborn type baby I'm very I'm so curious you guys I'm so so curious this Terabithia company um, I'm so curious about what their quality of their dolls is because you know what in the pictures she's beautiful and um, I did that a dolly that review on an a dolly doll and, um, I mean, it was just a disaster. You can go back and watch that video. Uh, a dolly sent me a free baby and it was just, oh, I was so awful, you guys. And I know not all their ba babies are awful. Like I, like I know of, um, many ladies that have ordered from them and were really happy with their babies. So, um, I just, mine was damaged, I guess. Um, anyway. Um, I'm going to go take some pictures of this beautiful girl and as always, take care.